can't begin to tell you the anticipation that everyone is feeling here in St. Petersburg, Florida for the Verizon IndyCar season. The green flag goes up. We are ready for our very first practice session. And With the moisture we've got in the forecast, both for potentially this afternoon and possibly tomorrow, all of that paint could be a really big issue for these guys. And that was a lurid slide from Juan Pablo Montoya coming out of the last corner. Uh, that was a very big catch there. He didn't want to start his weekend out with that car ending up in the wall, but that was about as sideways as you ever see an Indy car, and it's still coming back that Juan Pablo got there. Yeah, so uh, Montoya, who, of course, is a, an Indy champion, is right now taking a look at this race course for the very first time. We talked about changes. Here's one of my favorites. They're not going to move a car to the back of the field with a penalty like they have so many times last year. Now they're going to take 10 points away from you. For the engine change penalty, yeah. Yes. No, that's a, I think that's a great change because what it's doing is they're taking points away from the engine manufacturer when it's the engine manufacturer that has had the issue and had the engine blow up. When it's the team that is choosing to change the engine and the engine manufacturer says, well, we thought it was fine, they're taking the points away from the team. Mikhail will be very, very fast. And I believe Mikhail is going to believe that he deserves and will demand the same kind of respect from these guys that they believe he as a rookie should be giving them and that's not going to go down so well with some of these guys so i believe we're going to see him embroiled in some stuff but i think he's going to be first how about tony Kanan, car 10 he just drove into the runoff at turn 10 and he's got it under power let's see if he can get it back out of there hits the throttle and tony Kanan is back now we got two cars off, actually, uh, in one section of the racetrack. That's uh, Saavedra is one of them, and they go with the red flag as they, the, the IndyCar said that they were going to use that red flag, not a standing yellow full course. Uh, they're going to use the red flag and uh, stop these sessions, get things put back together as fast as they can. Turn number four, Joseph Newgarden has come to a stop. Here's our look at the replay. He was I think he may have just been overtaking someone, hit the brakes and could not control it and did not make contact with anything. Here is the order as it stands right now. We'll give you the top ten. Takuma Sato is still number one, followed by Graham Rahal. Will Power, third place. Elio Castroneves is in fourth position, followed by Simon Pagno. And then Ryan Briscoe and, of course, Hinchcliffe, the defending champion in this event. He's down in seventh. Uh, Dixon, the defending champion of the series, is eighth, and Bourdais sits ninth, and Ryan Hunter Ray sits tenth. Right at the end of practice, I just saw on the monitor Juan Pablo Montoya's car with its nose in the tire barriers. 